Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica and I'm here with your weekly advice readings for the week starting October 24th, 2016. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon and Rising. Thank you for being here and as always try to keep in mind that these are general readings so they're not going to apply to everybody watching or not in the same way. You can watch your Moon and Rising Sun readings for additional messages. Or of course you can get a private reading specific to only you and the link to my website if you're interested in a private reading or to check out that um, the, the special that I'm running the link to my website is in the description box below but for now try to keep an open mind and take away the messages of the reading that you do feel apply to you so <clears throat> Sagittarius you have an interesting week I feel like some decisions that need to be made um, some significant decisions that need to be made okay are happening for you this week and you may need to take some time make sure you clear your head make sure that you think about the long-term picture um, before you make these decisions so your overall energy is the two of pentacles and the two of pentacles talks about needing to make a choice it talks about the need for balance in your life at this time something is off balance and you need to restore balance so definitely make that your focus this week um, and you know this could be managing your finances budgeting this could be um, a busy time at work this could be choosing between people or choosing between relationships uh, or something to do with your health and well-being it can be anything but it does talk about um, a decision you have to make in order to restore balance this week uh, or whatever decisions you're making try to um, Focus on balance and um, keep that in the forefront uh, when you make your decisions this week. And the Two of Pentacles can represent um, two sources of income coming in this week, choosing between two people, um, prioritizing, having to stay on top of things, a busy week um, where you have to wear a lot of different hats. So definitely, definitely focus on balance and um, I feel like you're going to be okay. In career and finances, personal projects, education, we have the devil. So with the devil, you know, this is a major arcana card and it does talk about, it could be um, a focus on work this week where, you know, to the detriment of all other areas in your life. Um, this could be focusing too much on work, focusing too much on money this week um, and really overlooking fun time or your health or your family your friends your uh, romantic partner it can represent that for those of you the devil talks about a difficult situation at work where maybe you're dealing with an impossible bo uh, boss or impossible hours okay this is definitely um, an excess that's going on okay with the devil and with the two of pentacles uh, you may be looking at do i really want to stay in this job in the long run or should i be looking for a different job or actually you're starting to look for different jobs because you can't go on for very long with this kind of a situation. Um, the devil card can also represent um, working too many hours or working uh, too many jobs all at the same time. And it's just asking you to take a step back. Yes, money is important, but there's not enough money in the world for you to buy back your health if you do lose it because of uh, working too hard. So just something to keep in mind, okay, to put things in perspective and make sure that you bring balance into what you're doing this week. Um, the devil's not all bad. It can represent, you know, focus on luxury um, and it can represent money coming in for some of you from two different sources. And it's just saying, don't get too carried away with that. Make sure that yes, you enjoy that money because it is the fruit of your labor, but try not to go overboard. Try not to overindulge. When it comes to home and family, we have the hangman. So the hangman with the two of pentacles, you have some decisions to make, okay, this week with the hangman, definitely. And you're not sure what to do, okay? You're really not sure what to do. You need more information. That's what the hangman with the two of pentacles is telling you. And the hangman can represent, you know, taking some time off to figure everything out. And it does represent uh, revelation, enlightenment coming to you this week. But you do have to allow for this to happen. So try to clear your head. Try to stay open to possibilities, okay? Don't focus on just one aspect. Don't focus on just one direction. Try to stay open and just see what happens. And I feel like you're going to get your answer this week. You may be looking at, do I sell my home? Do I move out? 
uh, do I buy a new place? Do I um, buy a different place? Um, do I start a home-based business? It could be something like that as well. Whatever you do, remember to focus on the long-term consequences of your actions, of your decisions, and do whatever will restore balance in your life and you'll be absolutely fine. Um, but this is something that you need to make a decision upon before things can progress. So if you take too long to decide, nothing's going to happen, things are not going to go anywhere, you can't um, avoid making this decision basically, okay, is what they're saying. When it comes to um, emotional life and love life, we have the Four of Swords. Now with the Four of Swords and the Two of Pentacles, for some of you this talks about um, a decision to do with a relationship. There may be emotional detachment there and so with the two of pentacles you're thinking does this really have a future i'm thinking about the long term does it really have a future or do i walk away um for those of you i feel like this is a truth um a, a truth being revealed type of situation this could also be um honest conversations happening that allow for whatever arguments have been going on to stop um, and with the Two of Pentacles, again, it's all about restoring balance to that relationship. It's The Four Swords is also a card that talks about healing. So it could very well be that this is the week where you decide, okay, enough is enough. Um, let's talk this through and just see what we can do about it. For those of you, this is separation between you and your partner, okay? Potentially to do with work, potentially to do with um, family commitments or the other commitments that you have or that your partner has, okay, especially if you're dealing with an air sign, a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius, um, or an earth sign, a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. Um, for those of you, if you are single, I feel that you may be some, taking some time off this week, okay, you may be taking some time away from dating or uh, time away from um, trying to meet new people or trying to uh, get to know other people because I feel like you need to make a choice. You may have to make a choice between two people at this time. And with the Four of Swords, you kind of, you know, you stop dating other people and you're trying to focus on just these two options, uh, or at least two options that you have and decide which one is best for you in the long run. Again, you're thinking about the long-term future. Um, Yeah, and definitely if you're if you're thinking about you know keeping, uh, um, if you want to keep dating two different people with the four swords, they're saying you know you kind of have to make a choice this week, or you risk losing both these options. When it comes to your health and well-being, we do have the Hermit, and the Hermit talks about answers coming your way, solutions coming your way, things being revealed to you. Um, with the Two of Pentacles. And the hermit, this is information that is coming to you and you have to make a decision about about this information. The hermit is something being revealed. It's something to do with uh, potentially um, side effects or kind of it feels like, you know, after aftershock, okay, um, to do with a cold you had or pneumonia or the flu, um, anything to do with a lung condition. Um, I feel like it wasn't completely healed and now it's coming to the surface um and with the two of pentacles you have to think quick and you have to figure out what you want to do next i feel like you're discussing options you're discussing uh, what you can do with an expert and you're gonna take action and and restore balance in your health situation okay so it's not going to be too bad you have support there ask the questions you need to ask and then just follow the guidance you receive and I feel like things will be balanced out. Things, um, things, uh, good health will be restored. Okay, definitely. So overall, I feel like it's it's a good week. You just have to make some choices. You have to make some decisions and uh, think about the long term um, effects or consequences. And I feel like you're gonna do well as long as you um, focus on balance and everything that you do. Balance and moderation. It's gonna be a good week. Okay, so I hope that these make sense and I hope that um, the reading helps you. Um, thank you for being here. Hope you have a great week and I'll talk to you soon. Take care.